Welcome back to another West Country Tech video. In this video we'll be taking a look at two sites with the main priorities being security, internet and Wi-Fi. The first site has the majority of the equipment. As we enter the site we are met with both an ANPR camera and a bullet camera. The ANPR camera is there solely to track number plates of vehicles entering and exiting the site, whilst the bullet camera captures video and gives general oversight. This is crucial as it's the main entrance to the site itself. On the same building we can also find an outdoor rated siren. This siren is linked to an on-site workshop where both motion detectors and a keypad are fitted for arming and disarming the system. This can also be done using the smartphone app. In here we also find a gubbins box mounted which contains the main hardware, protecting it in all environments and next to it we see the network hub which speaks to all the parts of the system wirelessly linking them together. Further onto the site we can find another camera, a turret covering another key pathway through the farm as well as the 4G antenna which provides the site with a faster 4G internet connection. The signal is then distributed around the site using our wireless links which also send the camera signals back to the recorder. Then at the other end of the site we have three cameras all with specific jobs, a bullet camera covering a key pathway through the site, a TIOC camera used as a deterrent with the ability to sound an alarm and flashing light, as well as a tracking PDZ which is used to cover a main yard of the site moving on a schedule, also having the ability to detect movement and then track the subject as it moves around the area. All these signals are sent across the wireless links and back to the recorder where all the cameras are viewable live or through playback. This can also be viewed on the smartphone app. Then across on a separate site we have another PDZ used for watching the grain silo, monitor the cattle and monitor a gate entry to the site which is imperative that it is closed after use. This signal is then still sent wirelessly using a ubiquity wireless link across that mile distance and back to the recorder so it is viewable just like the other cameras on the main site through the monitor provided, it can also still be monitored on the smartphone app. 